Hi, I want to share with you... <laughs> Hi, I really want to share with you what I hope you're going to find is a fun and inspiring and a pretty cool project. It's where we get to be the media and share our story. So uh, follow along. You know, here in Wisconsin, we've really hit upon some awesome historic times. And um, the, the political events have really awakened uh, an awareness and we have really galvanized resistance and this resistance has been shaping the media. We've also, um, we struggle because so much of what we're experiencing is uh, untold. So what I wanted to do is, is help you because too much of the stuff that we're doing, you know, all these crowds, all of these photos, we're capturing this media, but it, the word is not getting out. It's unshared and as well, sometimes people are capturing and posting this stuff, but it's it's hard to find and it's um, it's not getting the traffic or the appreciation or the eyeballs it deserves so what we want to do here is igniting a new generation of citizen journalists citizen activists and a sea of witnesses to all that we've been experiencing there's you know we are the army of resistance to what's happening in Wisconsin and it's an entirely new generation of new media and um, social media has been a really essential key tool in uh, sharing these, gathering up the enthusiasm, the crowds, the momentum, and uh, inspiring and empowering this whole generation, this whole movement. What this platform is here, this project, Be The Media, is an opportunity to be heard. And um, there's a lot of different messages that are out there and some of the coolest ones that I've seen recently is the, the We're Still Here project. Democracy addicts and some really uh, insightful, really passionate people about what's going on in Madison have a program where you know, they're gathering up the video testimonials of the people who are involved to just say who you are, what your story is, and why are you still here. There's also as well People who, um, you know, as we're going out and doing the campaigning, the canvassing, we're hearing from people who used to be uh, Republicans about, you know, this isn't what I voted for. This is, um, you know, this isn't what I thought I was getting. There's another campaign that I was inspired by going on down, uh, actually in another state, but the uh, the idea rings true is the It Gets Worse campaign. It's kind of a a take on the It Gets Better campaign, but it's people talking about what's been happening and what's coming down the pike if we don't stay activated and if we don't get more effective at helping uh, reshape and, uh, and reclaim our democracy. And as well, there's um, just an entirely different segment of the population that's experiencing an awful lot of voter suppression, whether you're students or um, there are poverty and, and rural voters that are being disenfranchised and older voters. So there's a great deal of voter suppression going on and we want to hear and relate these individual stories. What, what's this one case that you're experiencing or that you know of? And uh, another campaign that we've seen is, is why is the Get Out the Vote campaign. Why are you a voter? What's what's important for you? So in this campaign, there's lots of different topic ideas that you can do. Basically, you want to make something short and sweet. Mean what you say, say what you mean, speak from the heart. You don't have to be an expert on the issues. You just have to know what's important to you and why you mean it. And it can be about your kids, your kids' education. It can be about uh, safety issues. It can be about you know, uh, election fraud, different irregularities that you've seen and you're uncomfortable with. It can be about the uh, the disparity. If we're so broke, why is there all this corporate welfare? If we're so broke, um, and as well, what about these cuts to health care, which eventually end up being even more expensive to our state and more expensive to society? Uh, other topic ideas, uh, you can correct a myth or a lie or something that you know to be 
uh, true that's not getting the play in the media. You can um, you can emphasize that this is not just a specifically a union issue. If you're not in a union, go ahead and say it. If you have other reasons for being a part of the resistance or for being upset with the uh, the current way of doing things, besides the fact, you know, if you're not in a union, go ahead and say it. There's a lot of people who are really upset that this is not the Wisconsin way. People seem to be cheating the system, uh, whether it's fake phony candidates in primaries or, uh, you know, voting to protect a lobbyist and a donor's interest that goes against the interest of their constituency. The cheating and the cheating of the procedures is just really inflaming and upsetting an awful lot of people. And uh, as well, talking about reducing taxes when in fact uh, it's creating tax loopholes for out-of-state large heavy business interests, uh, reinvigorating the, the Vegas loopholes and things like that, that effectively puts the burden back on Wisconsin taxpayers. Things that aren't protecting Wisconsin taxpayers that are actually making it easier for out-of-state companies to be Wisconsin tax dodgers. Um, the corporate tax deadbeats. So it's a pretty big issue for a lot of people. Now, the platform, what we're doing is we're empowering this social networking element. And, you know, there's so much of this movement has grown from Facebook. It's really gone and ignited things on Twitter. And as well, the YouTube videos that we are able to capture have been really... <laughs> really entertaining and inspiring and empowering. We're getting the truth out. And as well, there's a whole new uh, a whole new generation of other sites and citizen journalists, citizen blogs um, coming to really admire some of the uh, writing and media that's being created out there. So we're trying to get it all easier to find. This is what's an interesting part of this platform is that it ties so uh, nicely with the social media platforms and it'll give you actually lists of live links to the different profiles of people who are engaged in the process. You can find their messages by going to their profiles and it automatically does it. So as you join this platform and you connect it up with your Twitter and your Facebook links and uh, your YouTube, what it's, it's doing is it's not only uh, curating the list of who's involved but it'll even keep track of who's most involved. And it'll give you encouragement and participation points to go ahead and upload even more. And I'll, I'll admit, I think a video says a thousand words. This is even slightly biased to give more participation points to the videos out there. So even if you have just a whole bunch of still photos, um, if you go ahead and grab your links and put in your email address, I have some really cool easy ways for you to create compelling movies for free, really fast and easy. Something that you can upload to YouTube from still pictures um, and you can make a movie out of a, a couple of cool montage of still photos. So let's go over what the platform does here. So here take a look at this. This is one of the coolest things about this particular platform that is going to make it easier to you for you to find and follow and aggregate a lot of the different uh, media and stories that other people have been creating. And so this page might not be created here when you first join it. Uh, we have to have a certain number of users before that'll uh, show up. But the um, if you look down at the bottom of the screen, you can see that it has these little, um, you know, down here, you can go right to their Twitter profile or to their YouTube, or if they've got Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube, it'll actually keep track of all of that. Um, and then a little bit lower on, if uh, there's so many users it's hard to find, you can actually type in your username or somebody else's and search, and it'll find those for you. Now, you see over here, there are all of these different points. Go into more into that later. Um, it's really just encouraging you to be creating the media and sharing the media. And the more you create or share, um, the platform will actually automate it. Go ahead and find and track and award participation points for you. I'll describe more about what 
each action earns how many different points and all of that. But the whole idea is, is if you've got, you know, a story, a video, uh, a Facebook post, you want to share this with somebody, um, don't really have to worry about it as long as you're just um, tying back and using the identifying link, this platform will be able to go out and find that media for you and um, kind of curate it, bring it all into one place, make it easier for everybody to find. So that's pretty cool. Well, all right, so here's how we would go about uh, joining this platform, and it's really easy. Basically, you just get your links. So here you are on the page. If you came here from a different place uh, where you've seen the video, you don't have to click this. The video will just, it's, this is the video you're watching right here. So once you're at the page, you can just get your links. So to do that, you just enter in Just enter in any email address that you want to use for this and go ahead and there you go. And once you have done that, you can see that there will be points if you want to like us on Facebook, if you use Facebook Connect, and if you connect with your Twitter profile. And you can start by sharing your links below. There's a couple of different uh, choices of links you can use the um, share your story links and one of them would be the um, oh you can even email your contacts here but you can copy and paste this link down here there's the be the media link if you wanted the uh, media that you were talking about you want to talk about which uh, what your experience have been, you want to report on what you've seen, you can tag that with the Be The Media links. Uh, as well, there's also the um, I'm a Voter links. Same thing, this will keep track of either or. You can um, create more than one media and put uh, your media links on one and voter links on another. And another one you could also do is uh, the We're Still Here. So you can have any of these links you can tag your content with and this platform will be able to go out and find it and track it and actually award you your conversation participation points for doing it. You've got those different ones. We can even create some other links that you can choose if it turns out that as this uh, platform is growing you have different tags that uh, we want to use um, whatever that short little tag phrase is we want to append onto the link we can do that so um, there we go that's how you go about you input your uh, email address that used to be up here it says get my links and then once you've added your email address it gives you the option of choosing uh, which links you want to use and there's something else I wanted to point out to your attention right here is the uh, YouTube win bonus points from YouTube. Uh, like I said, this will find and track and um, award participation points for linking with YouTube. So if you were to subscribe to the channel, Wisconsin Recall, it'll be 50 points. And then as well, it encourages you to upload your own media or to use these links in media you've already uploaded. If you put this, any one of your uh, participation links into the beginning description of the video, this platform will go ahead and find it and actually award you those 50 points. So go ahead and do that too. Uh, subscribe to the channel. You can click on that link right there. That's live. It'll take you right to the YouTube channel. And as well, when you're creating media or if you've already done it, include these links here into the description of the video and it'll make it all a lot easier to find. Thanks. And emailing your contacts. You can send things out to Buzz, Facebook, Twitter. And you can also connect, like, connect, and sign in with Twitter. All of those options, uh, you can do one, none, any. Uh, you can even just get uh, participation points by including this in a link onto, say, a uh, blog post or a blog comment. We'll find you there. 
and uh, that'll be pretty cool. So thanks a lot for watching the video. Really hope to see what is your story? What do you feel? What um, What's your experience? Why do you care? Why are you a voter? Why are you still here? Um, just make this about you. Tell us what you think.